guys, so right now um, I'm in the Golden Nugget and today is our last day here, but I just decided to bring out my vlogging camera today. I don't know why, but I thought I'd try it and we're leaving today, so um, I want to show you guys the hotel room. It's really nice. I just got finished like packing up because we have to check out today. But like this is like the living room area. I don't know. That was really cute. And then this is I'll show you the bathroom. This is the bathroom. I like the door. It was like a sliding. I packed up all my stuff out of here. But um there's a shower. Like opens up like this and here's the bathroom and there's me and oh my headband is from Urban Outfitters so yeah so today we're probably going to go um, to over to the Tropicana to get lunch at like this Cuban place so I'm excited for that and oh and I want to show you guys something really cool if you open up the that oh yeah and wait this is like the bedroom is in here and he's still sleeping but um if you open up like the back door area wait I want to put this towel on the floor because I don't want to get locked out. <laughs> but if you open up the back door, it leads you to like this outside area and there's like a pool and the pool is so nice and it's outdoors. And like these are like the lounge chairs. They're super comfy. We've been out here like all weekend. And, um, if you go over here, let's see, out over there, and then there's, like, these cabanas, and if you want, you can, like, rent them out and get drinks and everything, um, but we didn't do that, obviously, and, um, I'll show you guys, like, cool area super nice oh and this morning I woke up early because I got like a spa pedicure which was like the same as regular pedicure um the only difference was the price and that was kind of annoying but it was still nice I got this like OPI color on my toes and I still had the little things on oh and do you guys like my rings I got them at Urban Outfitters this one says love and this one is like a cat so anyways the pool area is over here and sorry I'm so bad at vlogging I'm just getting used to this but it's right over here. This is like the hot tubs. These are the hot tubs and the pools over there. So there's like four hot tubs and we were in there like a lot and we were in the pool and there's something really cool. like these chairs that um the chairs are like half in the water it's like five inches of water and you can like move the chairs around it's really nice so you can like suntan over here like the other cool thing that I loved about here was they have these like 
fire pits. They're like these huge fire pits and they're really hot. But at night, they're like, at night it's like more fire and it's a lot warmer. I don't think it's on right now, but you can just like lay around here, sit around here. We were doing that like all night we were doing that. And then they have like a bar, so. And you can get food and drinks and just like relax out here. So that was really fun. And now I'm gonna go. I thought I would show you guys my like skincare routine that I've been using because I think that my skin has been getting a lot better and I've been using some new stuff. So I thought that for fun, I would show you what I brought with me and what I use um, basically every night on my skin. And I um, got this little bag at Forever 21 and it was like, I don't know, $2. And I like it because it's like easy to clean. So whenever I travel, I take it with me. <clears throat> so the first thing that I do is I remove all my face makeup with these oil-free makeup removing wipes and they're for a deep clean and they're by Neutrogena um and I just got these these I I like them I don't really have any complaints about them I like those but after that I remove my um eye makeup and I before I came before I left on this little trip I picked up these like mini eye remover pads from CVS so that I didn't have to bring my big one from home. Um, I do not like this. This takes forever to remove my makeup and I wasn't even wearing waterproof mascara or any waterproof makeup but um, it was really hard to remove my eye makeup with these so I don't really recommend those but yeah so once I remove all my makeup um, something new that I've been trying out that I've been liking is this um, Neutrogena I'm pretty, uh, Wave Sonic Face Cleanser. And I thought that I would try this out because um, I heard so many things about like the um, Clarisonic and all that, but I don't know if I'm ready to like invest in the Clarisonic. Like I thought that I would try out something like this to see if I even like this sort of um, face wash and I do I really like it it's supposedly cleans like 50 times better than your hands so what you do is like in here um, are the little refill pads and you just take one you attach it to the head right here and then you turn it on like this and then there's two speeds there's a slow speed and a fast speed. So the fast is for more of a deep clean. And then you just take it and like wash all around your face. And um, yeah, so you put the pad on here, you wet it, and then you wash your face. And I've been liking that. I think it's been good for my skin. Then something that I've really been loving is this. Clinique Step three, clarifying lotion. I use this every single day, twice a day, because um, that's what they tell you to do. And the girl at Clinique recommended this to me. Um, it's I have really, really problematic skin, and like this basically covers everything, like large pores, redness, um, dry skin, oily skin. This really helps me. So what I do is I take one of these cotton pads, and I just put like three little things of this onto the cotton pad. And then I just put it all over my face. And um, yeah, so I do that twice a day um, when I wake up in the morning. And then after I take my makeup and uh, cleanse my face, I do it at night. So I really love that. And then to go along with that, I've really been loving this moisturizer here by Clinique. Um, this dramatically different moisturizing lotion and I love this and it's like doesn't make my skin oily and it keeps me from getting dry so this is great oh and then I also did a lush bath while I was here um, I didn't use the whole thing but I used a lot of it 
This one is the bubble bar. Uh, this one is the comforter bubble bar, and I used a lot of it. I have like a fourth of it left. Um, smells so good, and it was really nice. So, yeah, so that was my skincare. I just thought I would do a quick overview on that, and um, I'll see you guys later, probably when I leave this hotel room. Um, I'll check back in. Okay, so it's like 12 o'clock now, and we're, we are uh, at the Tropicana. We just got here, so we're going to go eat some lunch. And, um, yeah, so this is what it looks like. Ooh. Isn't that pretty? And we're eating at this restaurant, Cuba Libre. So, yeah. Okay, so our food just came and it looks really yummy and um, we're inside the restaurant so good to see. Everything looks okay? Yes, yeah, thank it you. looks great, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> so um here we go. And this is what I got. I don't really know what it is, but oh well, it looks good. And this is what he got. It's like uh, some meat, and yeah, so we're going to eat, and I'll see you later. Okay, so we're still eating, and my food is so good. Um, it's like, it's called chicharrones, uh, I guess I think I'm saying it right, and it's like little pieces of like meat. And um, it's like has like the sauce on it. Oh my god, it's so good. There's like chicken and steak, like little things, and it's not too big, so it's not that bad. And um, these are like little plantain chips, and the sauce on that is so good. So that's really good. And Joel likes his food too. He has like steak um, and chicken. So yeah, overall. This was pretty good. Okay, so we're on our way home, which is sad because it's been a really good, um, relaxing weekend, and I'm definitely gonna miss the pool. Take exit 50 on the right onto US 9 North toward New Gretna. Okay, got it. Um, I'm definitely gonna miss the pool there and miss being there. It was really fun, but we're on our way home and. Um, we're gonna be home in like an hour and a half or something like that. And take exit 50 on the way onto US North. And um, oh, want to see something cool? I got this huge water bottle at the hotel or at one of the hotels, and it's so big. And I I wanted it because I want to start drinking more water. And like, I'm really bad at drinking like a lot of water. I don't drink enough. So I really liked this huge water bottle. But um, oh, and if you're wondering, on my lips, I have, um, I'll show you, I have it right here. I have Max, um, well first I put, Hold on, I'm just making sure we're going the right direction. 7.7 miles on Route 9. Okay, anyways, sorry about that. First I put Myth by MAC right here. And I love Myth. But then I topped it off with Snob by MAC. Yeah, so that's that, and yeah, I'm just bored in the car, and Joel is driving. Joel, what are we listening to on the radio? Uh, Kanye West. Kanye West's new album.